People in one coastal community are without an emergency room and will be for months for repairs from recent storm damage. But as Max Darrow reports, the district's longtime congresswoman says that that's not sustainable and is demanding more detailed answers. It may be small, but Seton Medical Center Coastside is home to the only emergency room along the San Mateo County coast. And the decision to close it temporarily is drawing heavy scrutiny from elected officials who represent Coastside residents, including Congresswoman Anna Eshoo. You simply cannot leave people without any emergency center on the coast side. The associate chief operating officer for Seton Medical Center says the closure of Seton Medical Center coast side is only temporary and was necessary to undertake extensive building repairs because of severe storm damages and major repairs. The temporary closure could last up to nine months. They're encouraging patients to seek emergency care and hospital services at Seton's Daly City campus. Depending on where you live on the coast side, that could minimally take 45 minutes to get there. In a life and death situation, that simply is not acceptable. Eshu is demanding more transparency and specifics. She wrote this letter to the director of the California Department of Public Health. I want to know under what circumstances they, uh, they made this decision. Uh, how can it be that all of these uh, people on the coast side are left without any emergency services uh, whatsoever? I mean, are they rebuilding a building? What are they doing? They need to be transparent, fully transparent. Seton's associate COO says the medical center considered keeping the standby emergency department open during repairs and renovations. However, this was not feasible because of the extent and nature of the damages to and condition of the facility, and that required ancillary services would not be available during construction. A lot of questions need to be asked uh, and answered, as I said, full transparency. In her letter, Eshoo says she copied the California Attorney General to ensure all laws are being followed and enforced. AHMC Healthcare, a for-profit hospital corporation, bought Seton Medical Center in 2020 after the hospital that was previously owned by a Catholic organization filed for bankruptcy. We reached out to the State Department of Public Health and are waiting to hear back.